Okay guys, I know that we do B-Day Mondays and today's Saturday and the thing is, is we're getting our bees in a couple weeks, two, three weeks. And I have, if I only did stuff on bee day, on Mondays, I would not be ready for the bees. So today, we're doing B-Day Saturday. And we're going to paint my, my thinking this is my problem is I'm a, I think I get I get thinking and this is a pretty color I like the color of it but it's a few shades darker than white like this one and, and and my thinking is is that in the summertime the whiter the better that's less work that they have to do to um, fan and cool off their hive and more time gathering honey and then in the winter time I'll just get black wrap and wrap this up in a black wrap so we're going to paint these boxes white in preparation for the bees that we're getting in a couple of weeks this should be fun keep on watching Open already? Yep. Getting that opened? Yep. Very good. So we just need to open up the cans, open up one of these uh, um, rollers. rollers, and we'll pour a little paint in it. Oh, why? You want to take the straps off of these here? See, this says unlock. Yeah. This pushes down right here. Okay. And then you'll be able to pull, pull that and then straighten it so it's straight. boxes off and we just paint on top of this on top of the dirt. Okay, we have our primer on. Now we're going to use our Royal Exterior Paint and Primer in One. Boxes are painted. Kind of a windy day. We got paint on us. The kids filthy. We got Cheetos on your face and 37 other kinds of flavors. My my question I'd like to pass off on to you guys is is on the front of the hive boxes right here. Um, I'm thinking about painting a different color. Maybe one red, one white, one blue. Um, the reason why is I'm thinking maybe bees need an identification so when they come home they, they won't go in the wrong house. I'm thinking that they, they, they go off a of smell but maybe it's easier for them to identify their house. Let me know what you guys think about that. I'm not sure. Um, I'd like to hear your guys' uh, opinion on that one. Okay, celebration isn't over yet. We're not quite done. We still have to put our tools away and clean them. And uh, then we're done. Yes. So, Shailen, you want to go get your brothers and have them come help us clean up? Yeah. Thank you. And you just want to lay right there and do nothing? <laughs> Thank you. You just want to cling on to mom? <laughs> Nap time. Yes. I'm thinking nap time. Fast approaching. Yeah.
All right, I'm eating licorice. And no, this is not sponsored by a licorice company. It's just a real healthy snack. It's good for you too. Science just hasn't proven it yet. Um, so, I kept my promise, I have not lift this up. I stuck this, um, I just know that the bees aren't in here yet. And we've come down at 50 degrees, they're not out flying yet. Um, and so I, I started getting worried. So I put some sugar water, one to one ratio, and I just kind of stuck it right here. And today was 53 degrees, and we saw a few bees flying out of the entrance and coming out, just like very few, like a handful. And none was eating the sugar water. And so, there, so that tells me two things. And let me know your opinion on this one too, because this is just a guess. They're not eating the sugar water because I don't know how big this cavity is in this tree, but they probably have plenty of food and they're just not worried about coming outside and foraging yet. And so, and, and, and there, there is bees. So we saw bees fly in and out. That tells me there's bees and they must not be starving because they'd be swarming that I'm sure. And so they're probably good. And so why am I feeding them if they're good? I'm just trying to make them feel comfortable to move into this box, maybe. That's, maybe I'm doing a bad thing. Maybe I should not, but I'm just kind of want them to, to get used to coming in and out of this box. And they're not even using the sugar. So, they did go in and out of this box right here. It's just, um, I don't know. Maybe the sugar water's a bad idea. Maybe it's a good idea. I don't know. Let me know your thoughts.